I'll be back, defeated candidate Clinton considers launching liberal television show to lay the groundwork for another White House run. Hillary Clinton is reportedly considering the launch of a TV show to keep herself in the news. The move would position her for a 2020 presidential run, according to an insider. She recently offered a toast to friends gathered at her Washington home, affecting an Arnold Schwarzenegger accent and promising, I'll be back. Clinton doesn't think Barack Obama will fight enough for liberal priorities, which leaves an opening for her to be the acknowledged leader in exile of her party. Hillary Clinton is considering another run for president, and is mulling the idea of launching a television talk show to soften the ground for 2020. Clinton would be 73 years old if she were to challenge President Donald Trump, again, and win the White House the next time around. Launching a TV program now would make her America's second oldest female news or talk show host on the small screen, after only Joy Behar of The View. Author Ed Klein wrote Wednesday on his blog that according to a Clinton insider, the former Secretary of State is open to the idea. She thinks being the host of a popular TV show would energize the Democratic Party base and her tens of millions of fans, the unnamed source said, according to Klein. It's a way to make a comeback and position herself for another run at the White House starting in a year or so. Clinton, Klein writes, recently told a group of friends gathered at her Washington, D.C., home. I'll be back dash and delivered the line in an Arnold Schwarzenegger Terminator accent as she raised a glass of wine. A planned comeback as a presidential candidate for the third time would preclude the idea of running for mayor of New York City. It would also take more lucrative opportunities off the table, including corporate boards and university chancellorships. But the Clintons are among the nation's richest Democratic politicians, reaping hundreds of millions of dollars in speaking fees since Bill Clinton left the White House in 2001, and one, the defeated Democrat sat stone-faced last Friday as Donald Trump was sworn in as president, and wants another bite at the apple. Among Clinton's barriers to a 2020 run at a TV show could only include public misgivings about her health. Last September she had to be dragged into her van after collapsing. Keeping up with the daily grind of a TV show would also allay fears among Democrats that her health is too frail to survive the rigors of the presidency. Klein's source said Hillary has been talking very seriously about a star turn on television. As a TV host, she discussed the issues of the day from a progressive point of view have top guests, interview world leaders and progressive thinkers. Hillary, in this scenario, would control everything about the show to make sure nothing unexpected could derail her future ambitions. She's convinced she'd get fabulous ratings in a political climate where there's so much anger in Democratic circles over Donald Trump's election, the insider said. It's unclear where a Hillary Clinton show would air, or when. But the source declared to Klein that Clinton is utterly determined not to fade into the background. She intends to stay in the limelight and keep fighting the good fight. She knows Obama is going to be out there fighting too. But frankly, she doesn't think he's a great leader or a great fighter, which leaves an opening for her to be the acknowledged leader in exile of her party, her party. If she get on top and turn around, I'm bussin' If she do that thing with the mouth, I'm bussin'